She's not trying to get away from the campus stalker. She's trying to find her damn car keys. Hold it a second. Maggie, give me some energy, okay? Well, Harry, can't I throw something at him? I feel like I'm running around like a helpless rabbit. Yeah, all right, good. Pick up something on your way to the door. No, Harry, I don't want to waste a lot of air time on this. Cut the struggle. Let's go right to the stabbing. That's totally out of character. Roxanne wouldn't let a guy stab her without putting up a fight. <sighs> okay, Harry. Take from breakaway. No, 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 no. All right, now look. He's got to stab her more than once. And not in the stomach. I, I want him to have him stab her in the heart. How gruesome do you want this? I want the audience to know that she's dead. I do not want to be getting any mail that says that she can be saved. You're going to get letters if he stabs her 50 times, Randy. Three. Three. That's nice. Three's a good number. Uh, okay, we're going to take it from Megan at the door. Jack, I want you to stab her in the heart three times. You got it? Thank you. You got what you wanted, Randy. Why not be satisfied with that? What's this overkilling business? Just do it, Jack. Three times in the heart. Thank you. Okay, take five, and then we'll pick it up from Megan at the door. Why? What have I ever done to you? I don't even know you. Please. You've got to stop these killings. There are people who can help you. Shut up. Oh. Take one. Take two. Please, please, somebody help me. Take one. Help me. This is great. With Megan finally gone, we can now get this show on the road to number one. Take four. I hate to tell you this, Randy, but without Megan, we're headed right into the cellar. That's garbage. That character's been dragging us down for a long time, buddy. Hey, her character's one of the more interesting ones on daytime or prime time. The moment this show airs, you're gonna hear dials all across the country turn to another channel. Harry, Harry, you got it all wrong. I've got my finger on the pulse of America. I know what the hell is going on. What is this? Freeze! Or I'll blow you away. Drop the knife. I said drop the knife! Stop the tape. Take four. On the ground, Camera two, give me a close-up on Tiffany. This is some stupid joke. It's gone on long enough. Do it. Stop the damn tape, Harry! Take your cross downstage, please. Um, I'll meet you in the library at five. Five sharp. Uh, five sharp. Great. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Tiffany has not lost her eyesight yet, Mary Lynn. <laughs> you all right? Yeah, embarrassed otherwise I'm okay. Bye, Roxy. Okay, camera one. Tighten to a close-up of Roxanne as we fade to black. Thanks, folks. We'll take a break and we'll pick it up in the dean's office. Give me a little tighter shot on that, okay? Hi. 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 Here's the um, information I told you about last night. 